mulamwa comedian ameacha kuchekesha watu kama ilivyo ada yake ama kipawa chake na leo hii ni story ambayo imekuwa trend sana pale kwenye social media na hii ni baada ya mulamwa kukataa ama kusema kwamba hataendelea kupokea ama hataendelea kuvumilia zile matusi na cheche ambazo mafans na mahetas wanampea kule kwenye kurasa wa Twitter na recently days kwenye kurasa wa Twitter nimeona mulamwa kitusiwa sana na watu wakiripost post zake kule kwenye Twitter na kisha kumtusi kusema kwamba mara anafanana na shilingi ile shilingi tano kubwa anafanana na huyo mtu ameshaorwa pale yule moyo kwa hivyo wamekuwa kimtuzi sana mara wengine wanasema kwamba jokes zake ziko dry hata zipendezi kwa hivyo jana ambayo ilikuwa siku ya Jumatatu tarehe 14 mwezi wa 4 mwaka 2020 mlamu aliingia kwenye Instagram page yake na akaweza kusema kwamba ameacha kuchekesha watu na ili dhihirishwa kwa vile alichoma shati yake ile ambayo huwa anavaa akifanya zile skits zake ama zile comedy na kama kawaida kuna mahetas kwa hivyo wamemfanya mlamua kuacha kuwa mchekeshaji tena lakini hili swala limechukuliwa na watu wengi sana na wakamkataza mlamua ama wakamwambia aache upuzi ama aache kusikiza mambo ya mahetas na aweza kurudia kazi yake ya kawaida na endelee kama ilivyokuwa kawaida yake na hii ni kwa sababu ukomedian wa mlamu ulikuwa mlandia job alikuwa ameshaanza kupata deals mingi sana kama kuwa host wa Talanda Mtani ambao ni show ya pale Kitien ameyo kuja Churchill show na pia kufanya endorsements kufanya adverts na vitu zinginezo mingi kwa hivyo nataka kusomea kati ya maoni ambayo wasanii wengine walimpea mlamua ikiwemo Karis, Memes, Nicky Big Fish, Ogwago, Jalango, Dr. Fweneke na wengine. Kwa hivyo nataka kusomea baadhi ya maoni ambayo wasanii wengine wakubwa walimpea mlamua kutokana na hii issue yake ya kuacha ucomedian. Karis Memes ama Karis Memes. Huyu jamaa ambaye anatengenezaga memes pale social media. Alimwambia kwamba boss, hizi ni gani tena? Ukijipenda kwanza hakuna kitu itawahi kutishia hii maisha. Self love. We, vile mimi napenda maheras. Eh, hey, wao ndio kusaidiaga ku grow kuliko mafans. Kazi endelee hiyo ni comment yake Karis Memes. Nicky Big Fish anasema kwamba I first experienced this when we started Naswa back in 2011. Ari first ilinihit sana nikazoea hadi siku hizi mtu akinitusi I find it funny. Kuna hadi mtu alisema nilikuwa na bahati ilienda usi. Otherwise nafaa kuwa mochari. Kazana omsiani wa ingo safari bado. Wago ambaye ni comedian pia alimwambia kwamba This is just the beginning bro. Never ever lose hope in life because no condition is permanent. Just ask yourself why you started this noble cause and you will realize why you are not in this world to please anyone. Remember only God knows how it starts and how it ends. So keep pushing no matter what comes your way, bro. Butita alimwambia, "Rise up again. You are destined for greatness. It's just a passing cloud. You are a great tondele kusonga." Kicha wanjiku from the comments you have plenty of advice that I think you should follow if you choose to what should you be thinking about right now is video yangu next content ni gani kazi lazima iendelee it must go on DJ Shiti anamwambia kwamba now this is real definition of trying to make everyone happy wezi hata ukifanya nini hawatakupenda sisi tuko mpaka na members of the family wenye tunasaidiana na kulipa school fees na rent marafiki wenye tulileta, tulileta Nairobi wengine tunazunguka nao tunafikiri ni watu na bado wanasema tutaisha cause hawaonangi kenye tunafanya ya maana na usanii wacha ujinga nunua nguo nyingine kuja tufanya kwa Made Nairobi City the best way to enjoy life in this industry is to focus so much on positivity Abel mtu alimwambia kwamba jomba kesho piga rest kesho kutwa sha, kutwa shati nyingine ikom alafu Thursday turudi kazi haraka fasta. Kwa hivyo Abel mtu anamwambia kwamba aende gikomba anunue nguo nyingine na kazi endelee kama kawaida. Your gift far much superior than a few people with miserable lives and cheap bundles. Wewe ni cham Buddha, tumekutambua. Na Jesse MC anamwambia kwamba I leave you with the idiom damned if you do and damn if you don't keep on what you know 
best. Kwa hivyo haya ni kati ya maoni ambayo mlamani aliweza kupokea kutoka kwa mfansi wake hafta kuchoma ile shati yake ya ukomedi na kusema kwamba ameacha comedy kwa sababu ya watu kumsaiba buli pale kwenye social media hasa upande wa Twitter. Kwa hivyo unaweza toa maoni yako hapo chini ili tuweze kujua utamwambia nini mlamua kuhusu historia yake ya kuacha ukomedi na kuacha watu wengine kwa sababu ya maheras na wale watu wenye kichwa kidogo. Kwa hivyo mimi namwambia mlamua kwamba endelee na kazi yake. Kazi yake asifanyie mtu endelee tu na kazi yake kama kawaida na kila kitu kitakuwa fit. Kwa hivyo drop down your comment, share video na like. Na tukutane kwenye video nyingine. Subscribe. Mimi najulikana kama MCMO. Naweza like Facebook page yangu MCMO Kenya. Na pia unaweza like my Instagram at @MCMO Kenya. Na tukutane kwenye hii channel kwa huondo zaidi.